Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we're stocking the pond some more. We're not taking the boat out, but we are going to some ponds. Yesterday, we stocked the pond with five nice bass, and today, we're trying to stock it up with bluegill. It's a little cold, really cold for bluegill fishing, but we're gonna send it, we're gonna give it a shot and see what we can pull out. We'll probably just be throwing red worms with bobbers. Make it simple, see what happens. Dad, Miller, you're late to work, my guy. Yeah. What happened? Uh, well the fuel plug went bad and then the battery terminal fried and so I had to go get a new battery terminal and then jump start the truck with the battery, yeah. Welcome oh. to the club. Welcome to the Welcome. old farm truck. Club. Hey, you got your tailgate back on. It's a little scratched up, but you know, yeah, yeah. it'll be all right. It's still, it's still on there. It's a work in progress. Work, work in progress. progress. What are y'all up to? We're gonna go catch bluegill. Bluegill for the Are you ready, Peter? I'm excited, dude. I'm, I'm excited, excited too, bro. Get for the pond? Hey. Yep, for the pond. I'm ready to see that. I'm ready to catch some fish out of there. Me too, me too. Yeah. The boy. Or hand feeding them. Oh, that's sick. Come here, tic tac. <laughs> Let me pet you. All right, guys, first order of business. We're going to run to a gas station, grab breakfast and red worms, and uh, maybe night crawlers instead. Then send it on to the good old local pond. Ladies first. <laughs> Fishing worms. How much more simpler can it get? Ooh. It's like we open it up and there's nothing in there. Nothing here. Oh, there's hardly anything. Let's hope these are fresh. Yeah, open those up. Open those bad boys up. Ew, what in the hell is this? Okay, we're not getting those. <laughs> um, let's go try red worms. You wanna open this up? <laughs> or add air on it. A little better. A little better. I'll right, grab those and grab these. Ooh, I want this. Should we get a spare and split it? Oh yeah, there we go. Mountain Zoo. Oh. I think that was a success. What do you think? Hey, that's a success. success. Did you see when she, she rang all of it up? Like she was like 23, like she didn't even scan them. I know. How did she do that? Nom, 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 nom. So good. Mm. Do you guys have this Hunt Brothers pizza where y'all from? It's like in every gas station here, so good. Well boys, you're about to roll up on the pond. Let's uh, cruise on down here and try not to hit a tree limb. That'd be great. The same pond that we caught fish out of yesterday. We caught all those bass. Look at it, there it is. Beautiful. Let's see if we can't catch like 30 bluegill today. We gotta truck all this stuff in here, so uh, stay tuned. Oh, man. Got the cooler in the back. Got the little little spinning rods. We'll carry the tackle box down there, get it set up. I am scared. It's a little cold to be bluegill fishing, but uh, we'll give it our best shot. See what happens. We need about 30 or so big old slabs. All right, let's see here. Get the red worms out. All right, let's 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 fill this live well up with this water. This water right here looks pretty clean. We'll fill it up and we'll start fishing. All right, boys, got the live well filled up about halfway. Um, we don't need it full of water. This thing's so big and so heavy. This is a 150 quart. We don't need that much at all. Most people use a 50 quart and we got a 150 quart. The fish do extremely well in it though, but uh, hey, let's get to fish and see what we can pull out. Let's get these worms up out of here. One thing I hate about live bait is dirty, nasty worm fingers. Let's see if we can't pull out a fish. I'm thinking the best spot in the pond is going to be directly across from us, but we couldn't get down to clean water there. So while we're over here, let's see if there's any fish over here. Good old bobber fishing. I ain't done this in a minute. There is. Oh no. I think it was a little too shallow, and it might have been just pulling it on the bottom. It looked like he was running with it, but he didn't take it down. Could have been a little baby something. Now we got a clean moss of off our freaking bobber and worms. That's gonna get old quick. Normally how it goes, fishing for bluegill. First couple, you gotta find them. Hopefully the possibility they're on beds. I doubt it though. Let's go over here to this other side of the pond where I usually catch bluegill. I'm looking to just throw it in and bite. Throw it in and bite. That's what I want. Go over here. This is the good spot normally, just a lot. Of lot to get hang up on down here. Gonna try to fish this creek down here. If they were bedding right now, we could wear them out. Oh, there's a bite. First one, baby. We're in trouble. He's tiny. I think I found where some might be, though. He'll be one of the best we pulled out of here yesterday's lunch, that's for sure. But oh well, we'll take him back to the cooler, throw him in. You got a little tick on him. Or something that's strange first little blue go right here boys little baby go ahead and get some oxygen to them it's not really the it's not really the size we're looking for but uh there's number one. Let's see, uh, see if we can pull another. Well, boys, the fishing's pretty slow. It's not the right time of the year for bluegill. We got three in the live well, but that is it. So I think we're gonna head to another pond. We're gonna go to where I know some of them bed up. I don't think they're bedding up yet, and that's why they're so hard to catch. We're gonna go fish these spots, and if all else fails, I got a pond. We can go throw a cast net in, and we should be able to get all we need within a couple casts. There it is. Got him. There's another, boys. 
He just got himself a concussion from running into the side of the cooler. Come on, take it under. He's moving it. Got him. Number three. Yeah. She thinks my tractor's sexy. Really turns her on. Da, 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 da. Was that a fish hitting the bobber? Would you just look at that? There's a fish hitting the bobber. No way. He ain't taking the bait though. He ain't taking it. Take the freaking bait or your mom's a hoe. Drugging down the road, I'm a blip, 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 flower. Oh, there he is. Take it, 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 take it. Stupid fish, take it. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, how you like them apples, boy? Little dumb boy? Or maybe you're a girl, oh God, oh gosh. Where's this hook at in his mouth? Bro, you took my worm, are you serious? You don't deserve to live. Bro, you gut hooked it yourself? Oh, uh, let's get another. So what we're doing here, boys, is I've lost motivation to fish, so now I'm just sitting on the cooler casting the rod and reel. We're going to catch a fish right there. Boom, 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 pa, boom, 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 pa, boom, 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 pa, pa, boom, 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 pa, boom, 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 pa, boom, 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 I'm sorry, Peter. I'm bored. Unless you're just like slap wearing out bluegill, this sucks. At least we got a big enough cooler for us both to sit on it. I feel like that's a dead beaver. Grab a trouble hook and catch it. Hopefully it's not the beaver from the other day. That was our bud, man. We became best friends real quick. He said, what y'all doing in our pond? I said, we trying to catch fish. He said, okay, y'all have at it. I don't even eat fish, dog. Ever since then, me and the beaver, best friends. Until we do a catch and cook, then he's in trouble. You, bobber, go down. Fish under it, grab hook, I set hook, we catch fish. I did a full 180. Baby, go crazy. You coming to sit down and join the party? Whose bobber's gonna go down first? All right, boys, it's time to go. Let's leave. All right, y'all, we just arrived at the next little pond. You guys can see it right there. All I can say is wish us luck because I don't have much faith in any bluegill fishing anywhere with how they acted in that first pond. So we'll just see, we'll, we'll toss around a little bit. See if these little rock fish that used to feed bass here are down in here. By the, oh, there, yep, they're just still down there. We're gonna have to get ultra small hooks, but if they're little rock fish, we don't want them. You see them taking it? They're little, little rock fish and not little bluegill. We don't want them. What is that? A bluegill? Hey, there's a little bluegill. Shocked I got a hook in that little dude. Pretty little thing though. If we catch about 40 of those, that'll do. Oh, they're down there. Oh shoot, this might work. Yeah, there's another. Oh, he came off. We might we might have to get smaller hooks, but this, this is definitely gonna provide us some fish. Look at little bobber, already going down. It's just if we can get the hook in him, that's the only thing. Look at it, he's about to take it. Yes sir, look at that, there's another. Hey, you wanna put him in the cooler for me? This, we gotta make sure, we gotta look at every fish and make sure they're not little rock bass or anything. See if we can't pull out another real quick. It's another, oh, nope, he came off. Throw it down again. Yeah, I just pulled out another one, he came off. Need to run small bait, but they're hitting it every time it goes down. You can probably throw a little jig and wear them out with a tiny hook. Here's another. Oh, I think that's a little rock bass right here. Yeah, here's a little rock bass. These things are mean as hell. Both those were bluegill, right? Yeah, I think the bluegill done skirted. Might explore the pond a little bit. Probably should have freshened up my worm. Come on, come on with it. Look at me, I'm getting ready. Come on with it. Take that baba under. Come on with it. Ooh. Is that a bluegill? Bluegill, bluegill, it's a bluegill. Ow, sweet. Bluegill, boys, first one in a minute. Oh, wow, I was literally taking my, is that a bluegill? Yeah, it's a bluegill. I was literally just taking my rod out of the water to go to this next spot and that little bluegill, boys. Can you open up the cooler for this bad boy? He's so heavy. See you, dog. Look at that one. Dude, that's what I'm oh my gosh, there's another one right Dude, here. All right, okay. you get that one, I get this one. Look at the size of that crawfish. <laughs> Look at the size. He's like a crab. Yeah, we're gonna pull him in the pond. That'd be great, lob bait. We got this little dude too. Let me see that one again. Turn him around. <laughs> that's a giant. And then there's another one right here, all, all under the same rock. We're we gonna throw him in the live well. Boys, here's crawfish number one right here. Peter over here flipped over one rock and there's two crawfish under it. Oh, let me get let me get a shot of yours. Look it's at that monster. Big Turn them. Turn them oh, facing up away from us. Very weird crawfish, dude. That is. That's a giant though. Oh, he a big Talk about son. great live bait. Hell yeah, great hey, live bait. Hey, you wanna throw them in the cooler? Bye, bud. Let's, let's get after. Let's get another. Get dude, you flipped over one rock. There's two. Every time I flip rocks in here, I've never seen one. I'm gonna get this rock right here. Oh, there's one. A and a bluegill. 
No. Yeah, look at the bluegill go. You did not just the, get a bluegill. The other one's right here. Where'd he go? He ran out from under. But it was another crawfish. Let's see when the smoke clears. He's sitting right there in those There's deep one. grass. You got him? Giant oh. dude. Oh my gosh! Giant. Oh my gosh! <laughs> He's huge! There's another one. Yo, there's a smaller one that ran under the rock. So there's two. Another one, another one. Where, where, where? I'll, I'll get him, I'll get him. I see him. No, one under the leaf. One under the leaf. Move, 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 move. There's two. <laughs> there's one right there and one right here. Get the camera. All right, y'all. There's one right here and one right here. This one looks bigger. Where? Where's Where's the other one? Look, look behind the one, the big one in the back. Look, look again. There's one right there. One, two, three on the wall. Look, right there. Where? Right there. Oh, shit. Get him, dude. Get him. Got him. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I thought he was dead and then he moved. He scared me. All right, he fell right there. I'm going to get this one. This one's pissed. I'm gonna throw them up on the bank if I get them this time and go after Don't another one. I want the big one. There's three right here. Go up on the bank. There's one right here, boys. Let's throw him in the live well. <laughs> that one's giant. There's so many down there. That was a monster crawfish. I'm gonna get down here and see if these. Yeah, this one's still right here. Another monster. Look at that. Another monster crawfish, boys. Hey, where I cleared that rock, look to see if there was any under it. Where I cleared that rock over there. Okay. Hey, there's another one down right there in front of you where I pulled those out of. We should have started downstream because now it's getting... Oh, grab them. Grab them. Is there another? Holy crap. I haven't flipped rocks for crawfish in at least 12 years, y'all. You see one? No way. Is he up in the drain? Yeah, all this water's so dirty under it. Got him. Got him? Yeah. Another one right there. Another one bites the dust. I'm going to check up here across the road in this ditch. I don't know. Oh, there's one. Oh, no. No, but he is fast. Look at that, boys. There's another. Another one. Dude, we're racking up on crawfish. Man, this place is just filled with crawfish. Oh, you get them. Grab them. Grab them. You got them. Throw them up. Throw them. Just throw them up. There's another. Another little one right there. Yo, I got another spot we can go check for crawfish. This went from stocking bluegill to stocking crawfish real quick. There's another. We just keep pulling them out. Another baby, smallest one yet. Great, great live bait right here. This one's like so soft. It's weird, some are really hard and some are soft. Let's go ahead and get a warm on, see if we can't pull any more bluegill out of here. I don't see the water boiling right here. I don't see any bluegill beds. Usually the beds are right here in front of me. Toss in there, see if anything's down there. I like those ponds where you roll up and you put the bobber in, you already got fish hitting it. Oh, you got one. What is that? Bass, that's a good bass. Oh. On the little jig, the little grub, dude. That's awesome. This place is so, has so much fishing pressure. You throw something a little small and simple like that, they'll just hit it. There is one. A little bluegill. Oh no! I was walking him over and he came off. Oh boy, it's never try to walk your fish in the water over to the truck. You're stupid if you do, because they like to pop off. Fish this area, I caught him, see if there's any more. A lot of times there's one, there's two, and then you got dumbass throws his whole rod in the water. <laughs> Speaks them all. That's a slab, boys. Come on. That's a slab. There we go. That's what that's what we're looking for right there. They're here. We're seriously about to wear them out. I'd get your rod. I need a bucket of water so we don't have to walk back and forth from the truck. Alright, this shouldn't take long. I'm pretty sure they're just all up in this corner. Yep, the bluegill are in here. It's time to stock up the pond, son. You get one? Oh slab daddy. My boot's gonna fall off. Oh, there's one. There he is. All right, you're cooler, man, since you're not rod man. <laughs> I wasn't joking. If you can't catch the fish, at least you can put them away for the video. I can't catch the fish. You can kill the fish is what you can do. Say that again, you're going back in the pond. No, no, say no. I won't say it again. I won't say it again. I won't make any jokes. No, don't do it. Don't do it. We need him. He'll love Garrett's Pond. Here's another one. Yes, sir. He's a fighter. Look at him. Look at him go. Oh, sorry. <laughs> now that's what we want right there. Look at that. Beautiful. That's a beautiful fish. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Ha. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Ha. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Ha. Here's one. I don't think so. He's coming in, but he's. Big in. Oh, what a chunk. Man. You get him? Slab, baby. Slab, daddy, right here, son. There we go. Damn, that's pretty. Oh, I got a bite. Got what the f is that a bass? That's a bass. 
No, 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 no. Right there. That was a that was been perfect fish tank bath. That would have been Bath G 2.0. No. Oh, you got another? They were on the bank. There's one. You're taking three, son. Oh, yeah. He was barely hooked. The hook wasn't even set. There's one. What's that? Five or six? Yo, what's happening? They just started a feeding frenzy or something. Here's another. They're getting smaller. All right, let's get these to the truck. Show them up. <laughs> All in one little go. Oh, boys, I'd say it's been a good day. What would you say, Peter? Great day. Long Great day, day, but good day. Long day, but good day. We're gonna go ahead, head over to the house, transport all these fish over to Garrett's Pond. I'm sure those bass that we put in there yesterday are gonna be happy about this. Come on, cameraman. Hurry up. Alice. Day two of stocking Garrett's Pond. Let's go. All right, come on, big muscles. Let's get this cooler out. Miller, we got so many fish in here. Like, like over a hundred? No, like 40 or something. Oh my gosh, open it up, let me see. It's filled with water and really dirty right now. Look at the pond, y'all, it's looking good. I'm loving it. You better hold on to that thing. Oh, it's heavier than it looks. Peter, you're on aqua date duty. Start a doc, a doc in these fish. Who's a doc waiting this camera? All right, let's go ahead and get the battery hooked up. This thing, we've been running this live well with this battery for the past two days. And it's been working so good. Get get the water bubbling. Let's go ahead and pull the drain plug, get some water out of it so we can see what we're doing. Uh, yeah, one's already sucked up in it. The water got slow. But uh, let's drain some water. Get them, uh, what's the word? Adoctuated, acclimated. Let's get them acclimated to the there pond water. <laughs> then just, just start dumping fish in this thing. The pond, I mean, this is a lot of fish for this small of a pond. It's gonna be perfect. So Miller, you know how I was talking last night about how we shouldn't have got such a big cooler? Yeah. I mean, it works great, but most people are on like a 50 to 70 gallon live well, and that's like a big lot live well. Yeah, how many gallons is this? This is 150. Oh my God. 150 quarts. You guys didn't need this. Pretty big. Yeah. You could fit a human in here. No, Braden. I'm not testing it out. <laughs> <laughs> There's a big one right there, son. Big one, son. Yeah. This one that's bigger, dude. There's a bigger one than that? Yeah. You gotta get out all the crawfish first. Okay, we have a couple of dead crawfish in here, I think. Not doing too great, but where we're pulling them out of, a lot of, there's like dead crawfish already in there, so I don't think they were doing good to begin with. So maybe uh, we're saving them. Yeah, I don't know what was that. Well, actually, yeah, I do think we're saving them. Saving them out of that little spot they were in, but uh, they should do they're probably gonna die in the pond not like just die naturally they're gonna get eight so eight. yeah they'll be good for something do bass eat a lot of crawfish oh yeah they love them we got big bluegill little bluegill medium-sized bluegill we got all of them so this is perfect and we do have a couple hybrid bluegill in here which shouldn't be too bad i mean i'm not too worried about it so uh what are they hybrid with uh i'm thinking like this like this uh rock bass kind of thing i'm not sure we can't figure out the whole the name i'll look it up i think it's a rock bass is that all the crawfish oh, no. we about slamming there he is right there kill him, kill him. Ah! oh god there's two of them y'all got a lot yeah were y'all just doing with the nets or with the hands or? hands oh my picking god. them off oh my god look at them it's a whole bucket full of them oh my god look at the big one down in there holy yeah, crap you're just gonna release them all at one time let them eat yeah we'll release them. them all at one time that's all of them dude that's all of them hey you want to try to reach down here and get the big one out for the thumbnail huh? <laughs> <Is that him? laughs> I like them. There's the two big ones right there. Here's another bucket full of them. Let's go ahead and dump this bucket in there. We're going to get a little thumbnail real quick. All right. Bye-bye, all you crawfish. Well, crawfish made it. They're looking good, looking healthy. Let's go ahead and release these uh, big old big crawfish. Old jumbo. We might actually go get more crawfish here soon, but uh, for now, this is a great start. These are both super hard, so they're they're pretty healthy. You're going to take off. Look how pretty they look in the water, man. They just sink on down to the bottom. That one. Ah, oh, they're fighting. they're fighting. Oh, God. Please, by the butt. <laughs> oh, we're about to have a freaking brawl right here, son. My money's on the big one. <laughs> Dude, they literally they're like this with each other. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. All right, let's get these bluegill in the water. Let's get a quick count up of how many bluegill are in here. I'm just going to start throwing them in and counting them. Okay. One, two. Look at that black on that one. Oh, my gosh. That two. Really pretty. Three, four. That was a good one. Five. Look at that one. That one's really pretty. Six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, look at this little guy, <laughs> 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. And Peter's head, 24, <laughs> Peter's head. 25, 26, 27, all right, speed past my guess, 28, 28 29, 
30. 31. Mm -hmm. And the last one, 32 fish. Heck yeah. That's crazy. Good I'll just pond release. Stocking, man. That's a lot of fish, dude. Yeah, 32 fish. <laughs> we'll, That's great. We'll That's yeah. awesome. Man. They're all like small, medium, large. Yeah, we got, we got all the sizes. Dude, I think we do need to go ahead and put more structure in this pond. So probably do that off camera. It'll just be a little work. You want to do that today? Yeah. Build some more structure for the fish. I think that'll be fun. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe. If you guys want to see more of this little habitat kind of thing we're building here, uh, this should be a fishing paradise here in a little while. The fish are about to spawn, so we're doing this at the absolute perfect time. Yeah, Peter, you got anything to say? Pond's looking great. A lot of work still to be done to it, though, but we're starting somewhere, man. We're getting it done. We're getting it done. Y'all, please like, subscribe. Get this video to 10,000 likes, y'all. I love you guys forever. I know you guys kind of chimp out on some of the fishing videos, but uh, I think I think this is getting entertaining and this is getting fun. We got a lot more to do and uh, cannot wait to come out here and bass fish this thing. So like, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.